Hey guys, the question is Square Enterprises is considering a new three-year project uh, expansion project that requires an initial fixed asset investment of 2.29 million. Here the uh, other data is given in the description box. You can check out the description box. So here let's start. First, we calculate uh, operating cash flows for year 0, 1, 2 and 3 and then we calculate projects NPV. So here let's start. First, we calculate projects uh, oh, sorry, operating cash flows for year 0, 1, 2 and 3. So here cost savings. Cost savings are uh, revenue minus cost. So here revenue is uh, 1,715,000 000 in annual sales. Sales is this and cost is 624,000. So our cost savings will be 1,715,000 minus 624,000. Same for year 1, 2 and 3. Here depreciation is initial fixed uh, investment is of 2.29 million. So here we will uh, calculate depreciation using MACRS schedule. So the MACRS rates for year 1, 2 and 3 are, 3 are as follows. For year 1, 0 0.3333. For year 2, 0 0.4445. And for year 3, 0 0.1481. So, the depreciation will be 2.29 million for year 1, 0.333. For year 2, 2. Point, sorry, 2.29 million into 0 0.0, 0 0.445. For year 3, uh, 2.29 million into 0 0.1481 0 0.1481 so here now we calculate profit for tax so profit for tax is equal to cost savings minus depreciation copy the formula select the cells and paste the formula now we calculate tax as given in the question that tax rate is 21% so here we will calculate tax on profit for tax at the rate 21% so profit for tax into 21% now we calculate net income net income is equal to profit for tax minus taxes so here is net income now we will add back depreciation so depreciation is this now we calculate operating cash flow, uh, net income plus depreciation. So this is our operating cash flows for year 1, 2 and 3. Here in the question it is given that um, the project requires an initial investment in net working capital of $260,000. So it will be an investment in net working capital. Uh, so in year 0 it will be investment and in year 3 it will be received so it will be a positive value 260,000 initial investment 2.29 million and now we calculate after tax salvage value as in the question it is given that the fixed asset will have a a market value of $195,000 at the end of the project. So here we calculate uh, a market value, sorry, after tax service value. So the cost of asset is $2.29 million. Depreciation charges is equal sum of uh, depreciation for three years. So written down value will be uh, asset cost minus depreciation charged. Sales value of machine. Here market value will be sales value. So it is $195,000. $195,000. So here mm, there is a profit mm, because sales value is higher than the WDV value. Now we calculate tax rate. Sorry, tax at the rate 21%. So 25,311 
into 21%. So the after tax service value will be one uh, one thousand eighty nine sorry one hundred eighty nine thousand six hundred eighty four point six five so it will be our after tax service value here we will take it in year three because now we calculate uh, operating cash flows for year zero one two and three so year zero it will be Um, uh, so for year zero, uh, the free cash flow is is equal to net working capital plus investment. So here it is uh, negative to 2.55 million or um, 2.55 million. Now we will calculate for year one. So for year one, it is one 102217397. For year two, it's one zero seven five six five zero point zero five. For year three, uh, operating cash flow plus net working capital plus after tax service value. So it is one three eight two seven nine five point nine eight. So these are the operating cash flows for year zero, one, two, and three. So now we calculate NPV of the projects. Required rate of return is nine percent here. So here we calculate required rate of return. Is, sorry, present value factors. So is equal one divided by bracket one plus nine percent. Then bracket close. Then power power of time. Just copy the formula, select the cells, and paste the formula. Now we calculate present value. Free cash flows into present value factors. So now we calculate NPV. NPV is some of these present values. Uh, so the NPV is three three thousand sixty sorry three hundred sixty thousand eight hundred ninety nine point six two dollar. So as NPV is positive, the project should be accepted. I hope you understand the calculation. In case any doubt, you can ask me through comment box. And please subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.